So Gaucho Racing is UCSB's Society of Automotive Engineers chapter. We're also a senior capstone design project and a club on campus. Uh, each year we build a race car to compete in Formula SAE Electric. During COVID, our school was all online and myself and some friends were really getting into racing. And we thought, is there anything we can do in college, you know, as engineers to kind of explore that and maybe grow some skills and develop and be better engineers. And we found Formula SAE. In engineering school, they teach us basically everything you need to know to design, to manufacture, to build, to test. But the one thing that you really have to learn is how to work in a large team. Because anybody can make something small on their own, but to make something larger, more impressive, more successful, it takes a lot of people and you have to be able to work together. Gaucho Racing, uh, as much as it is about building a car, it's also about the people. When people join Gaucho Racing, uh, they don't join to be a part of history, they join to make history. Uh, what we are building here, we are building a legacy a foundation for future automobile engineers. Building a race car is not uh, cheap. It's very expensive. It's an incredibly logistics heavy operations. When companies sponsor us because they believe that they are investing in a new generation of engineers. Yeah, Single Store has been an amazing supporter of our team. Just having the security of knowing that you've got a great company who's got your back and is able to come to campus and do events with us and help train members of our team on your platform has been amazing. So in the early days of actually planning out our architecture, we you know we, we talked with some engineers from Single Store who kind of guided us and showed us you know certain parts of their platform, certain features we could leverage. One cool thing was the Single Store notebooks. So being able to run notebooks in real time from live data that we're getting, we're able to collect all of the signals from our car and send them to the cloud in real time. It's a really powerful platform, especially their ability to ingest such a high throughput of data at very low latencies, specifically for our batteries. For example, like cell temps, we could see our cell temps increase or decrease based on what state we were in the car, and we could graph that out and see exactly where and what happened in our accumulator. Significantly uh, decreased our like troubleshooting time, especially when compared to last year. Data is huge in all racing across all, all, all categories. Do, it's manageable to be able to design and build something, but you don't know how good it is until you're able to test it. Our car is comprised of a series of microcontrollers, or nodes as we call them. Uh, this year we actually added a, a bunch of different sensor nodes, and these include things like suspension travel, you know, tire temperature, brake temperatures, brake pressure. Being able to actually validate it in the real world under testing is like very valuable, and that's something we didn't have last year. This year we know what specifically is going on, who, who is sending it, and we can analyze all of our incoming data, which is really helpful. Last year was our first ever car. We're a very new chapter, a very new team. We got a lot of things right in that we were able to make a car that rolled and suspended itself, but we also had a lot to improve on because it basically just wasn't uh, ready to come together in time for competition. We just had our first successful test and we were able to pull a whole bunch of data from our car for, of course, first safety systems, but also telemetry. We could see the movement of the car for GPS so we can get the acceleration, the speeds we were reaching and the cornering gravity um, forces as well. People were screaming and shouting when the car even first rolled. It's pure excitement. I know a lot of these guys, they've been waiting for this moment like their entire academic career, career here at UCSB. A lot of time I spent debugging the car, figuring out what's wrong. It's just, I was very happy seeing it work. Great day. When the foot goes on the pedal, being able to see the motor move, the car start moving, is, is unbelievable. I'm very excited about our car going to Michigan because we can actually see our car, see our product, see it move, see it work, see it score. Being able to have the working test today before going in, it gives everyone, I think, a lot of confidence going in. I'm incredibly excited to go to Michigan. I'm incredibly excited to see all the hard work culminate on track. This entire thing could not have happened without Single Story, that's for sure. Yeah, now that we've got a stable platform and something we can grow off of, I'm really excited to see how the team's going to perform in the future and uh, be able to support them as an alumni. It's about incrementally improving from year to year. And if we can keep that improvement going, <laughs> who knows where we'll end up in, in like five, ten years. Woo!